but with uh, Susan McKelvey and Andy Frost, both picked today for Team Scotland. Great moment for you. Susan, you were desperately close four years ago, but this time you're going to Commonwealth Games. Yeah, I can't believe it. Um, last time was devastating, so to be named today, I'm just over the moon. It's a, such a weight off my shoulders, and I still can't believe it, really, um, because the last couple of times um, I've actually been picked, so it's a big achievement for me, biggest in my athletics career. People in the athletics community in Scotland who you know train on a regular basis, they'll know that that's years of hard work that you've put in for that. Yeah, they, most of them say I'm the most unlucky athlete because I've missed out there's so many times. So I know that they'll be really happy for me this time. Um, they know how hard I've worked, so um, yeah, definitely. Andy, yourself, going back to Commonwealth Games again, looking forward to it at Hamden? Oh, definitely. Um, we went there earlier in the year for the experience and the crowd was just amazing so like I said earlier if that's uh, if it's like that next year in Hamden it's going to be brilliant uh, hopefully get some big throws from it and I'm thinking you've got a bit of a connection with the squad because you know all the hammer throws and you were saying you know Nick Percy from a very young age yeah I've known Nick since he was uh, I think he's about 10 or 11 he used to come down the track to train um, some hammer and discus with me um, I remember he used to talk a lot which uh, he's not, not so bad now but he's, uh, he's doing really well um, very talented lad and I think he did well in Glasgow do you think there's going to be a real bond between the whole team? There's going to be a large number of athletes that are there, all doing different disciplines, but you do seem to have that little bit of bond, you know, you are Team Scotland. Uh, I think so, yeah. It's always, I mean, athletics is an individual sport, but I think when you get to, to get people like Team Scotland, you kind of grow, grow closer and everyone supports everyone. So in Delhi, it's a good, uh, good sort of atmosphere between all of us, and it's only a small team. So I think next year it's going to be a big team. It's going to be an even better sort of atmosphere between us.